Good morning, students. Today, let us try to learn on how to add rows to a data frame using append function and concat function. Let us have a look at each of these functions. Pandas data frame has a method called append which add new rows into an existing data frame. Here in our example, we have our data frame name as df1. As you can see here, the dictionary D is being converted into data frame and we name that data frame as df1. The column names are student names, role and section. And here we have the name of the students along with their role number and the section of the classes as A and B. And here we are printing or displaying the dictionary D. And here we are displaying the data frame. Now let me run this program for you and let us have a look at the output. So here we have our dictionary. As in the program, we first print it in the form of dictionary. So the output is also in the form of dictionary. Whereas here it is in the form of data frame because we convert that dictionary into a data frame. So this dictionary is now being printed in the form of a data frame. And now you can see that there are three columns in our data frame. They are student's name, role and section. And there are three records for this data frame. The name of students are Albert, Bapin, Christine and Daphne. Now that we have our data frame, the F1, we can try to add, to do that, we can use the append function. So let us append another data frame called df2. So before that, we have to create a data frame named df2 with three columns and few rows. And after that, we will append these two data frame. That means the rows from the second data frame will be combined with the records of the first data frame. So let us have a look. So to save time, I am just copying these codes for creating dictionary from the previous dictionary. So now here I need to change the names. So let me change the names of the students. Since we want to add new rows to the previous existing data frame so i'll add another four rows here that means four students name so these are the names now for roll number also let me change here these are the roll number for these students and let me change for section also so here i'm changing the section after that we are printing the dictionary and then convert that dictionary into data frame. So our new data frame here, the name of our data frame is df2. So here we have our new data frame df2. So we'll print that data frame first and then we can use a pen function later. Let us now check the output of this program first. So here I am running the program for you and here we have the output so this is from the first part of the program that means we created dictionary d and the f1 data frame whereas this here is for dictionary d2 and this is for the data frame the f2 so now you can see here there are four rows in each data frame now we can use append function to combine the f1 that means we are adding new rows to df1 or we append the df2 data frame rows into data frame df1. So after adding the rows using append function, then we will get a new data frame df3. So here let us check at the output of the program. As you can see here, we have our data frame, the first data frame, second data frame, and the third data frame. Here, this is the first data frame. That means the F1 that we created. Next, we have the F2. 
and this is the output after adding the rows from df2 with those of df1 so that is how we use the append function to add rows from one data frame to another data frame another possible way to add rows into an existing data frame is by using concat function here we have few lines of codes for concatenating the two data frames so here our new data frame after concatenation is df4 and we are combining df1 with those of df2 so similar to append function we will get a, a data frame whereby there will be rows from df1 and df2 as one data frame so here you can see before we are using the append function and this is the output and down here we are using the concat function so this is the output after using concat function that means we are combining the rows from df1 with those of df2 so that's all my dear students about adding rows into data frame using append function and concat function.